how's it going everybody? It's me, Skadog. Thanks very much for joining us. As you can see, we are back. We're playing some more WWE 2K. We've got some trades going on. So we finished the pay-per-view and now we've got some trades. They want to trade Gulak for Ivar. Can I just see you've finished your rivalry? Yeah, we could. We could accept this. No cash. They're going to pay us to take this. And this gives us as an immediate someone else to face Grimes, right? I'm not against this, you know, let's accept it. Good work, Heyman. Oh, that was that was the only oh no, we got more trades, so I can attempt to trade. Is there someone I want to swap for someone else? There probably is, right? I don't know who. Um so we got your rivalry to end. We've got you who's gonna be in a rivalry with you. Two specialists together. I don't know how I feel about that. We got you still in a rivalry with these guys got these guys in a rivalry which we need to end i don't know if i've got anyone i need to swap i think we're okay right we've got a pretty robust roster which even though isn't particularly amazing is okay i do think we need to, to tidy up uh some stuff hey what was that stunt you just pulled um you know what I mean, you've literally screwed me over this week just gone, mate. I have to say, you really crushed it with the last show, Game Recognized Game. Um, thanks. Just a note of caution, now that Grimes has a stamina below 40, he's vulnerable. Okay, we know that. That was from the last game. Back in Pittsburgh, can't wait to put on a show for my crowd. Okay, listen, I'm not feeling 100%. I don't mind pain, but I don't want a serious injury. We're just going to call you out anyway. When a superstar returns from injury, they gain 10 popularity. Uh, talent scales cost 50% less cash. Generous, generous commissioner. Whenever you complete a commissioner goal, you have a chance of earning an extra random power card. We can take this one uh, because, you know, we, we do quite a lot of these. Have your most popular available female uh, face and heel fight. So there's a couple of things we want to do. We want to come here and we want to do a call out and we want you to call out you, right? Perfect. Then we want our final event to be, hold on, before we go any further, we've got two of these. We need a steel cage match, I think, right? One of these unlocked steel cages, this one. Because then we can go back to this and we can say you versus you in a steel cage, which should end the rivalry. A thousand fans resolves any rivalries gain, granting an additional fan per rivalry level. Huge. Okay, so that's that one. What have we got going on here? So your rivalry ended. So if we were to take you uh, as a bruiser heel and we want a fighter face, right? That's you too. And what if we had Shotzi run in? Does that help us? I don't know if it does. Who is our actual tag team? Our tag team is you two, right? We've got this problem with this rivalry. I mean, I guess we could try and do another steel cage match and just throw these guys in and see if it ends. But I don't know how that's going to go with you being a, a, a heel now, but... We'll have no run in for this one. What if we were to, hold on, move you down. And then we were to say. It's a lot of money. Hold on, that's not the rivalry, is it? The rivalry was Dakota Kai, who's now in a match over here. So I think we've just got to accept that that one's done for. So let's move you back down. And let's do our tag team. And we want you and you versus... I don't think it matters anymore, right? You and you. You 
you two are okay for this. We have got a rivalry on it. Okay. So what if we tried to blow off this rivalry? It's only level one to be fair, right? So I don't know what one's better. I'm guessing this one. You failed our commission. You have your popular, most popular available female and female face and heel fight each other this week. So our most popular is definitely you, right? Who else is our most popular? So it's you as a heel, sorry, and you as a face. Okay, so we need, this is just a mess, but I think we need to do it, right? Let's get rid of you. Let's turn this into a triple threat. Let's put you in here. And then what do we do? What if we had... Shotzi and, and Fanny fight each other? We can do that, right? Okay, then we can do some calling out, potentially. Uh, you may as well call out... You? Hold on. You? We'll just see if we can get another another thing going on there. And then I guess we need some money for sure. It's expensive, but I think it's worth this is gonna be worth blowing off that rivalry for sure. Um What have we got over here on power cards? We've got the legend one. Raises the selected superstars morale, might not be bad. Do we need anyone new? I don't think so. We're fulfilling this, so we might get two of these. Uh, what else have we got? If we hire someone, we're gonna we're gonna pass that. Use ten power cards against other brands. Book five shows where every match has had a different type. Okay, we can't do that just yet. We're gonna fulfill another. Um, we're gonna fulfill another promise. We've got a tier two over here, so that's good. Um, the only question is whether we want to do a scouting for someone and see who we find. But even if I did, let's have a think about this. So once this is ended, right, we need to know who's going to win, right? We have to do it at the end of that. Whoever wins, we then need a new rivalry for, and we're going to have somebody else who's then available to fight. You know, the good news is about having all of those people out for last week is we've got pretty good stamina i think we're ready to go everybody uh this is it let's get it done ecw got some new new talent in ricochet is in don't think we've seen him before uh andre chase versus nakamura Okay, let's move on. Blair Davenport versus Becky Lynch again. Was that again? I feel like it was again. Um, okay. And now is, now is us. So our triple threat match. We really like Rhea and Dakota to get a rivalry. If it's Hartwell who wins, we've got problems. Oh no. Oh no. So Ripley and Kai... That's what we wanted. But Hartwell's now got the belt. Okay, good. Which means we've got a champion with two champion belts. Uh, Ju Gulak and um, Grimes is good. Level one for you guys. Uh, Fanny and Shotzi. Shotzi wins in a mediocre match with no rivalry. Uh, 
Theo Hall, I'm intrigued about this women's tag team. Theo Hall. Uh, sorry, Hale. And uh, Stratton. Okay, good. Next up is our uh, rivalry we're looking to grow here. Hazen Jensen wins and it does grow to a level two. Love that. Some advertising from Stratton. We needed the cash. And then this should see this one end, right? We should wrap up the rivalry here. Breaker wins, huge, into a classic four and a half star match. And the rivalry is complete, huge. Our curve should be pretty good. And it is a good booking. Uh, we got some rivalries that we... No, I think the rivalries we got are ones we wanted to an extent. Uh, okay, let's have a little look. ECW, 103 show rating and 51,000 fans. Um, 52 grand in the bank. We spend quite a lot of cash this time around. But let's have a little look. Their arena crowd is 1.4 uh, and they're charging 2.7 uh, per ticket. Imagine it was $2.07 to go to watch the wrestling. Um, I'm guessing it's not. NXT, 98 show, 59,000 fans, and they've got the 2,000-seater arena with two th with 4,000. Um, Raw, 98 ranking, 46,000 fans. They've got the $2,004 show, and then a 68 grand in the bank. And then us, a ranking of 100. We've got 52,000 fans, and we've got the uh, 31 grand. We're up to 181. No, I hate that SmackDown traded Ivar for Duke Gulak. In my opinion, I see where I've got the better part of the deal. Maybe, but we've got a new a new rivalry. Another match ruined by DQ. Way to go, Fanny. Uh, such a good way to close out the rivalry of Bron Breaker and Randy Orton. I wonder what will be next for Breaker. Great SmackDown tonight. Good match. Fear got a, ra a great reception from Pittsburgh crowd. Um, love having her around here. Boring sellout promo by Tiffany. Really like tonight's match with Bron Breaker and Randy Orton. One of the better player classes. Really very show. Uh, never seen Carmelo Hayes so dominant before on, total, on, total, on a total rampage. Bron Baker gets payback on Randy Orton. Contract negotiation. Love that. We get a second one. Health Spa. Love that as well. Okay, let's have a little look here then. 1359 versus 1358 versus 1345. Our budget is still healthy, but not as healthy as we'd like, especially if we want to go for the next arena. Uh, what have we got here? I've seen you, you've seen the work I'm putting in, I know I can do more for the brand, I'm ready to run a main event. Um, are you though? Are you though? I mean, we can give it to him, right? That's fine, you can have a, uh, yeah, you can have a main event. What have you got? I think you should put me in a match with Lee. Trust me on this. Next three weeks, we can make that happen. Okay. The Hayes wants the main event. We can do that, right? We'll give him a tables match. And we'll get you in versus these these chumps again. There we go. Perfect. We want a one on mat one match between Grimes, maybe, and you. Let's just see if we can get the rivalry to grow. Uh, your stamina is coming down. You are an intriguing one. What are we going to do with you? I think we need to put you in a ta tag team match. With... I think we're just going to see if we can blow this off. I don't know if this is going to work. Right, this is the rivalry that we want gone. Uh, I guess I can make it steal. To try and achieve that. Don't know if I want to. And you can only assume that that's going to be better than that, right? But I don't know if that matters. Uh, mid card, what have we got here? Brom Bre we need an opponent for Brom Breaker. We need a fighter. Um, and we need someone to then start facing Orton. So we need a fighter against Bron Breaker. He's injured now. He's, he's too tired now, but.
Okay. What do we say Bron Breaker was? He was a he was a bruiser, so we need a fighter or a specialist face. Okay. What are you going on here? Jive Owens. We did like a bit of Jive Owens last time. Let's not go for Jive. Let's go for male. Let's go for face. Let's go for fighter. Or let's just go for specialist. Dragonoff. Butch. Tyler Bait. Uh, three of five. Three of five. Three of five. They're all identical. Special guest referee, backstage brawl, no hold bars. Um, I think we go Dragon off, you know. Or maybe Tyler Bate. Tyler Bate's got more stamina as well. More money out the out the window, but now we can say call out Tyler Bate calling out Brom Breaker. Bold. That bold that mate. <laughs> right. What if we did a Who is Randy Orton gonna face going forward? He's a fighter, he needs a bruiser or a specialist the other way, right? Maybe once some of these are done. What have we got here? We got a specialist. I could potentially throw him into a freeway for this, right? What if Randy called out Gulak? And we'll see if we can get a fight or freeway like rivalry going on for that one. That feels like a, a triple threat, sorry. And then finally, I guess we get you to do us some advertising. How do we feel about this? Steel cage opener. My gut feeling is it's going to be better than this, but what was our... Have at least one extreme rules match. I can't afford both of these. You know that, Trips. 70 grand on this. Is it worth it? Probably not. We really want 200 grand in the bank and we're about to spend 70 of it. We're never going to get the money back for that, but it would give us... have fulfilled this and that, in theory, gets us two cards. Um... I do like the idea of another contract negotiation for 20 grand. But it does only add two weeks. When they come up for free, that's pretty good. Um, I don't think I can afford to do this as much as I want to. You know what? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. This is huge. This is a huge waste of money from us, but I'm doing it. I mean, it might blow off our rivalries and so on and so forth. Okay, our opener. Steel cage match. We're seeing if we can get rid of this rivalry. It'd be bad news if the other ladies win. That's good news. Rivalry complete between Hartwell and Stratton and all of those in an amazing match. Love that. Uh, we get an okay promo, but no rivalry. We're looking to grow this rivalry. Grimes wins and we get a level two rivalry. A great match. Call out. Excellent promo. Nothing happening there. Uh, Lee versus Fanny. She, Fanny is calling the shots around here right now. Is there a rivalry? Disappointing. You told us to put this on. What were you thinking? 13 grand. I love that. Okay. And then this one. We're hoping this gets rid of our our rivalry as well right it grows the rivalry uh, our rivalry grows between these guys so it's now level three and we have new champions okay um another miz versus loomis match that seems to have been going on forever as does becky versus uh eo sky Okay, who's that brute force in the middle there versus Strowman and, and LA Knight? Um, love that. 
ECW, normal matches all round. Um, John the Fisherman, I think that is below below this match. Who's that dude in the Who's that dude in the shiny jacket down there? It's huge. Okay, I'll confirm this one as well. We had a great opening. We had a great closing. An amazing bookie for us. ECW smashed it with their last match. What have we got? Quo show quality ninety nine. Um, we got 49,000. We only made 18k, but that's okay. 49,000 fans for us. Man, what an end to the rivalry between Hartwell and ha Hale and Kay and Stratton. Almost didn't want it to end. Great SmackDown tonight. Good matches. Can't believe I just lost money on Fanny breaking that losing streak. Tiff Stratton and Dakota worked okay as a tag team. Gulak came up short against Cameron Grimes. Hold on to that strap. Uh, it was so intense with Cameron Grimes and Drew Gulak went at each other. Tension was palpable. Slipman and Dijak and new champions. Not sure the best superstar won tonight. Be seeing you again, Tia Hall. Uh, don't really get why SmackDown want to push Indy. SmackDown making a good pickup with bait. Okay. What we got going on over here? 54,000 fans and 55k. 36,000 fans and 66k coming in. And 46,000 fans and 63k coming in. I think that's just closed a bit of everything. This is nice. We need that. A new contract negotiation helps as well. So Heyman still top of the pops with 1405. We're 1395. And Ted DiBiase 1394. Stephanie lagging behind a little bit. We're going to leave it here. We'll be back with another episode uh, soon. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see next episode early, please go and check out YouTube members where it will be available right now along with every other video that we upload with early access. Thank you so much. I'll see you again soon.